on today's Travel Bites with Liesl81. Welcome, here's the keys to your castle. Today I want to take you with me to Kajuru Castle in Kaduna State. And then you have the Nigerian flag. It is made from raffia and it's a chess table right here. It's called the Dragon Star and that means the dragon lies just beside the tower. But there's a story about our dragon. What is it? Is it an African crocodile or what is it? To be precise, it's an hour from Kaduna City or an hour from Kashia. What I love about this place is that when you rent it for a couple of hours or days, it is totally yours and you can experience a medieval castle right in the heart of northern Nigeria. And Kaduna Castle is home away from home in the middle of nowhere, as you can see. Now let's talk about the surroundings. It is within the backdrop of rock formations, granite and a beautiful landscape that the Kajuru Castle is located. It was built a couple of years ago by a German who saw how well it suited into the landscape and sought to make it like a holiday resort that could privately be rented. You have five rooms at which you can lodge in at Kajiru Castle. Uh, the building behind me is the Dungeon Tower, and the Dungeon Tower contains four of the rooms. And actually, when you are here, you are left to your own vices because there is no Wi-Fi, there is no TV, and you have to go back to the old school way of communicating, talking to each other. So you have several ways of enjoying this property. One of them is taking an hour's tour, which we did, and the other is to rent it out for a day or the weekend. So I'm gonna take you through this property and I hope you love what you see and that you decide to come visit it at the end of the day. So join me, let's check it out. So this is a typical beer garden table and chair. So if you've never been to Germany and you want to feel like you're in Germany, you can literally come here and drink a beer. Okay guys, this is the interior of the common room and in line with the medieval uh, architecture you've got the decoration showing weaponry from the medieval times and they are actually in the original waiting and also plaques with dragons and you know what you would use back in the days. So let me show you. So this is the living room area and what I love here is we've got the night obviously is the view from the window so let's show you that. This is a crazy crazy bookshelf but it's not only a bookshelf because here you go you can actually go through this door um, but we've heard it's the ghost that lives there even though I don't believe the ghost. A library with a lot of German books and I'm so excited. I'm going to show you this one from Elisabeth Schuler. Das Grundkochbuch der Deutsche Küche, which is a cookbook for the German kitchen. Let me see a uh, Tiefkühlfisch um, with no pictures so I cannot show you the pictures of the... Oh, I think I see one. I see one. I can show you a picture of something. Oh wow, here you go. So. Uh, Mariniertes Refilet in Butter. Heinrichs Wald erbaut in dem Jahr 1985 bis 1989. That you can really dip yourself in when the sun comes out. But I see patterns of something in the base. Is that a leaf or something or leaves? So guys, this is the end of our one hour tour of Kajuru Castle. So I'm gonna sum it up for you. It is a place that you can call home away from home. So what you can do here are three different, all four different kinds of packages. The first one is a one hour tour that costs about 20,000 Naira, where you get taken around the premises and you see the different rooms. You also can get to see the eating, the kitchen, the dining area, which also gives you that feel of the medieval times that this castle is themed within you have the pool area and the pool area is definitely a perfect eye catcher because you've got a view of the Kajuru area where we are and you get the rock formation you have the 15 minutes rock on this side and the one hour rock on this side what you also have is an oven you know a native oven where you can bake a grill exactly so it's a stone 
oven where you can, you know, bake cake or pizza. Oh, perfect. So there's a suspended cooking pot area. Oh, perfect. Okay. A sauna and also the bar area here right to my right. And it's a beautiful place where you can spend the night or a um, weekend. They've got two floors where you can actually have parties that take up to 150 people dancing. It's never been commercially rented out, but they're working on it. So that's it for me today at Kajuru Castle. I do hope you come visit and I hope you have a great time. I had a great time at this tour. Come check it out and I hope you love it as we did. Bye. Thank you very much for watching. Yours truly, Lisa81.